Welcome to CC Biology TCP. I am Mr. Wilson from the TCP Academy. You can find us online at tcp-academy.teachable.com. You may also find us on YouTube at CSEC Biology TCP. Today we're going to be looking at the May June 2022 paper for Agricultural Science Single Award Paper 2. Now we're going to be looking at question number 5 today. And you might have seen our long list of questions that we have been answering to make sure that you move closer to that A for agricultural science. Now, of course, if you have not yet liked, share, and subscribe, it is time to do so. Now, when you subscribe, please be reminded to click that notification bell and select all so you'll be notified as soon as there is a new publication. Also, we want you to leave a comment. Tell us which school you are from or which island you're watching from. Today, we want to say hi to Gabby from Steertown Academy, who pretty much commented on our video, our 2022 video. Gabby, we're seeing you, and we do hope that all the folks at Steertown Academy, they are all tuned in to CSEC Biology TCP on YouTube, be that they are watching our biology past papers or whatever video, HSB past paper, whichever of our videos, or agriculture, whichever one, we do hope that they are going to be doing their best. And of course, dreams will be coming true in the CSEC exam. We're going to be looking at question number five today. So let's hop right into that. Question number five. Figure six shows a breed of goat found in the Caribbean. We are tasked to identify the goat shown in figure six. Now, there are many goats that were here in the Caribbean. We have the British Alpine, Sanen, Talking Bird, just to name a few. Now, which of these goats do we have here? Indeed, it is a Sanen. Say two purpose for which this breed of goat is reared. Of course, this is cheaply a milk producing goat, but of course, reared for both milk, meat, and in some cases, manure. And, of course, the hide. But chiefly, it is reared for milk and, secondly, for meat. Farmer Jeff produces broiler birds. He noticed that his current batch of birds looked droopy and had diarrhea with blood streak in their droppings. Identify the disease that is affecting this batch of broiler birds and state the agent that causes the disease. This is going to be an easy one. Streak of blood is a giveaway. Definitely the disease is going to be coccidiosis. And the causative agent is always going to be a protozoan, or you might hear protozoa, or you might hear protoxis. All right, great. So just three ways Farmer Jeff can control this disease on the farm. First, Farmer Jeff need to remove the sick birds from the flock. He could treat them with exome salt and, of course, use medication such as we call it coccidios. That, that could be used. Any of the three methods could be used to treat with the coccidiosis problem. Advise Farmer Jeff on two recommendations that he should adapt as part of a total disease management program on his broiler farm. Now, there are many. Use a foot bath at the entrance of a poultry house. That's the first one. Keep the litter dry and turn it regularly. You're supposed to cull sick birds. Infected birds are to be burnt and, of course, destroyed. Visitors should not be allowed to enter the poultry house. You're supposed to wash waterers and feeders regularly. This takes us to the end of question number five. We do hope that something here will be adding to that which you already know. And of course, you're getting closer to the A in your exams. Remember, please like, share and of course subscribe when you subscribe please be reminded to click the notification bell and select all 
so you'll be notified as soon as there is a new publication like the video when you like the video it will go to your playlist and should we turn this video off you will still have access to the video you want to share the video that as many persons as possible can get it and you will be getting more videos as the algorithm will be showing you more of these videos to get you that a for the exam you want to leave us a comment that we can pretty much understand where you are and what is it that you want us to help you with. once again thanks much for watching please be reminded to again like share subscribe comment and click the notification bell until we next meet remember to study to show thyself approved Last year, many students differed on their CXC exams as they were afraid of failure due to their level of readiness. This year, Mr. Wilson and his experienced team from tcpacademy.teachable.com is here to help you get exam ready. Subscribe for free to tcp-academy.teachable.com. We offer courses in CXC Biology, HSB, English Language, and many others. There are several offerings to each course. Enroll in one today.